Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to discuss the gate previous problem of mechanical paper, which is given in the 2023. Let's see the question is, with reference to the economic order quantity, that is EOQ model, which one of the options is correct? Here, graph is given for the order quantity versus cost per unit and also represents the various curves. Options are given for the various cost which is related to the different inventory cost. In the previous lecture, we already discussed the various inventory cost and also we know that one the purchasing cost or production cost is fixed and constant moreover it is not depend on the order quantity so here curve p4 represents the production or purchasing cost carrying cost or holding cost is proportionally vary with order quantity so here curve p2 is carrying or holding cost Ordering cost or setup cost is inversely proportional to the order quantity. So here curve P3 is the ordering or setup cost. And also we know that when the total cost is the summation of purchasing cost, ordering cost and carrying cost. And it is initially decreasing with respect to the order quantity and later it will be increase. So here curve P1 is represents the total cost. So here curve P1 is the total cost. Curve P2 is the holding cost. Curve P3 is the ordering cost or setup cost. And also curve P4 is the purchasing cost or production cost. Let's see the options and observe that one the Option A is curve P1 is the total cost and curve P2 is the holding cost and curve P3 is the setup cost and curve P4 is the production cost. So option A is the correct one. Next we will see the gate 2022 problem. The demand of certain part is 1000 parts per year and cost is 1000 rupees per part. So here that is the annual demand capital D equal to the 1000 parts per year and the cost per part that is capital C equal to 1000 rupees per part. The orders are placed based on the economic order quantity that is EOQ. The cost of ordering is 100 rupees per order and the lead time for receiving the orders is 5 days. So here ordering cost that is the C0 equal to 100 rupees per order and the lead time is the 5 days. If the holding cost is 20 rupees per part per year the inventory level for placing the order is dash parts. So here it is given the holding cost that is the CH equal to the 20 rupees per part. Then we have to determine the reorder level. So this can be we can be determined by the applying the reorder level formula that is the ROL equal to the lead time into small d here small d is the daily consumption rate so maybe if you not remembered the these formulas we can be solve this rol by applying the concept of uq so we know that one this is here q star that is the evoq and here t star is the optimal order cycle time and this is represents the 
reorder level quantity that is the rol so this is the rol and this is the lead time here observe that one the so it is the look like a two triangles and these two are the symmetrical triangles then you have to apply the symmetrical triangles properties then we can be write as a q star by rol q star by rol equal to t star by lead time that is a t star by lt we know that when the q star that is the eoq equal to the root of 2d c naught by ch so in the data it is given the capital d c naught and also it is given the ch by substitute the these all the values in the q star equation we will get the q star that is the eoq equal to the 100 parts and also we know the optimal order cycle time that is the t star equal to the q star by d we know the q star that is the 100 and also we know the capital d d that is the 1000 so then the t star equal to the 1 by 10 year but here observe that when the lead time is given in the days then 1 by 10th year we can convert into the day, days that is 36 days so here we know the q star we know that is the 100 pass t star also we know that one that is the 36 days and lead time is given the 5 days then substitutes all the values in this equation that is we will be get 100 by rol equal to the t star that is the 36 divided by lead time that is the 5 then we can be write rol equal to the 100 into 5 divided by the 36 then rol will become the 500 by 36 this value will get the nearly 14 parts thank you